Windy City here in Chicago, Illinois. He's Ray Ferraro. I'm James Sabalski. The crowd is hopping for this one. We'll send it down to ice level. Ray Ferraro between the benches. What are you seeing for tonight, Ray? Well, I'm looking at a team, each team that's going to try and impose their will on the game. Play a fast game, play a physical game, try and take your game onto their doorstep. Both teams lined up in the middle. We are ready to get things underway. The Blackhawks start with possession as we are now underway. Takes the feed from the left side. Chicago's got the puck against the boards. Shot in front. Oh, what a glove save. Taves has won the draw. Puck grabbed by Keith. Denies him on the play. No quarter given here as they battle for the loose puck along the boards. Gets that puck back on a stick. Chicago's got it along the wall. Takes the feet at the back end. What a stop! Scooped up along the wall by Nylander. Again the denial by the goaltender. Chicago's got it in the offensive zone. Moves it to Nylander. Moves across the point. From the opposite point. Takes the shot. Oh, what a stop! Grabbed along the board by Saad. Chicago's got it near the point. That's off a stick. Scrum ensues along the boards. The Ducks take possession in the defensive end. The Blackhawks have it in the offensive end. Blocked in traffic. Obstruction penalty coming up. Looks like a hook here. Time for the officials to hand out the judgment. Hooking the call and maybe a little sell job along the way? A little bit, but the player's got to move his feet. As soon as you stop, if it's even close, you're going to get nabbed. Anaheim sending their power play unit out for the first time tonight. Well, hard work earns the first power play of the game for them, and... Now they've got to take advantage of it. They'll start with the face-off, of course, in the offensive zone. And manages to clear the zone. Anaheim's gained possession along the boards. And now he moves it to Richie. Drives it to the front of the net. Makes the save. Flashes the leather right in the slot on a difficult chance. won the draw and they'll go to work and forces a huge turnover here with the steal gets it out of his own end Anaheim's got the puck along the wall Richie's got it into offensive territory here's a chance on the doorstep denies him and manages to clear the zone slides away from his crease now to play the puck Time winding down here. One last chance with this man advantage. They've spent too much time going up and down the ice. They've got to get it into the zone quickly. Receives the pass. Shuts him down. Well positioned save, and he has the rebound over in the corner. Puck picked up by Mata. Through the neutral zone up along the wing. With some momentum driving towards the net. And the puck departs the zone. Takes him from the right side. Here's an odd man rush. Slides it across, and he blocks that one. Puts it in deep. Crunches him into the boards with the stop. Richie's not letting anybody off the hook right up against the wall, and he throws a heavy hit. Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. And that's blocked. Gets in front of it.
puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. That's a solid hit. Passes over to Kane. Kane's got it in the offensive zone. Now a quick pass to Gustafson. Stops him cold. Raquel's gaining momentum. Getzlaff's going to play it against the half wall. Here's a short pass to Fowler. Tripped up on the play. Delayed penalty coming up. Let's see the call here. To break it's called for tripping. He's off to the box. Reaches in with his stick and gets nabbed for the trip. And they'll roll the power play unit right back out. They've been skunked on the power play so far tonight. So you have a little chat on the bench. Guys, notice some things that the penalty killers do. And you try to adjust one step ahead of them. Trying to get something going here with this man advantage as they start from their own end. And it's a quick pass to Getzlaff. Puts it on goal. Denied by the blocker. underway and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. Can't get it to go. Chicago's got the puck now. Gets it out of his own end. Kasha's has got it across the line. Wrist shot from the slot. Oh, and he completely blew it on that miss. Yeah, you got to get it on the net, James. You've got an opportunity to score and you don't even test the goalie. The Ducks will play the puck from behind the net. The Ducks fail to capitalize on the power play. Really aggressive work by the penalty killers. They shut that power play down without any danger. Puck is dropped and play resumes. Up along the wing. Anaheim's got the puck along the boards. Over the line they come. Chicago's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Slides it across to Kane. Kane's got it along the wing. Right up front! And he slides it quickly to Seabrook. Lays the body. Anaheim's got a hold of it against the wall. Chicago's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. Nearing the final 60 seconds here this first period. Musa quickly over. Oh. He scores! The captain leading by example! Wow, that screen looked like it was just about perfect, didn't it? He doesn't even react as this puck goes by him. on the board here. They've got the opening goal of the game here late in the opening frame. All you want after the first is to be even or ahead. They've done most of it. Now you have to finish the job. Camp's got it against the boards. Move to the middle. What a steal in his own end. Time of the goal. 19 minutes, 33 seconds. Well, it's an opportunity for fans to stretch their legs here as the opening 20 minutes comes to an end and a chance for these players to catch their breath. A lone goal is the difference so far through the first 20. It's a 1-0 game. Fans take a look to the sky. Both teams Both heading teams down the tunnels. We'll take a quick breath ourselves and be back for the second period. everyone he's Ray I'm James second period set to go well after an intriguing opening period here we go it's period number two puck is dropped and we are underway one period already in the books Ray how have you seen this thing Chicago's probably pretty happy with that first period that they played 
They had the puck a lot, but what they have to change is they trail by one. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. 1-0 the score. Taves wins the faceoff. Taken by Keith. And now he moves it quickly to Saad. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Slides the puck down low. And he slides it quickly to Saad. And a beautiful stop by the glove. Gets last one the face off. Fowler's got the puck along the wing. Here they are on the attack. Snaps one on net, gives them nothing in front. This is a quality chance that the goaltender turns aside right from the slot. Offense his own face off and he wins the draw. Comes up with the stop. Keith's carrying it ahead. Now a quick pass to Nylander. Comes up with the stop. Lifts the stick and takes the puck. Puts it wide. Maybe trying to be a little too fine as he shoots it wide of the net. Ahead of steam now towards the front. Over the net it goes. Often you're not even really aiming this. You just want it in the top half of the net. He ends up shooting it a few inches too high. And he loses both the puck and his balance after that hit. And that one's broken up. Great block there. Kane swooping in on the attack. Takes a shot. Blocker save. Anaheim's regained possession of the puck. Intercepts the pass. Let's it go and makes the save. Pretty efficient save there. The goalie helps the D-man out by putting the rebound in the corner. And now he tries to get it across to Richie. Moves the puck along the half wall. A chance right in front. Scores. That's back-to-back, -back, Ray. Well, the, the game has changed. Those two goals here really have changed the outlook. Now coaches talk about getting to the front of the net, make it difficult on the goalie, take his eyes away. Man, he only could see the player's butts in front of him. He can't even see the puck. The Ducks make their way back to center ice here with now a two-goal lead in the second. Nice to pad the one-goal lead. They played well, and now they've earned this spot in the game. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. Takes it at center. Quick feed to Kasha. With possession along the wall. Sends the pass over. Eight minutes, two seconds. Oh, great play to use the wall handling the pass. Chicago's got a hold of it along the wall. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. Puts the puck on net, and there's the save. And getting another look at that. Man, did he take a big hit. Now he's got to go collect his bucket that popped off. Here in the back half of this period, Anaheim's really controlled the pace of play these last few minutes, leading by two. Here's a shot. Takes it right in the chest. And there's the whistle giving him a chance to exhale. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. Good Branson's got it in the defensive end. Here's a chance. Jones looks around. Stopped by the goaltender. Move to the middle. Steps in front of it for the block. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. Play whistled dead because of an offside. Uh, the defenders can regroup right now. That's a long time they've been chasing the puck around in their zone. They look like they've got nothing left in the tank. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. They've got numbers. Looking to make something happen along the boards. And it comes up with the save. Anaheim's gained possession along the boards. Taken along the wall by Getzlaff. Carries the puck through the neutral zone. The Blackhawks get a hold of the puck in their own end. Moves it around along the half wall. Scores! The 
this is the default move for the goaltender here. It's like every shot, he drops into the butterfly. He gets beaten clean here. Chicago's got new life here in this second period, Ray. It's amazing what a goal does. The energy on the bench changes. Guys can't wait to get on for their next shift. Carries it in. And it's a quick pass to Kasha. Big save by the goaltender. Chicago's got the puck along the wall. On the attack along the boards. Let's the wrister go. Blocker saved by the goalkeeper. Handles the puck. Here's a shot. Oh, it comes up with nothing on the play. Officials blowing the play dead. We've got a penalty on the way here. Shore's going off for hooking. So quickly into position. Now the defensive player's got to scramble. He takes the hooking penalty. Chicago's man advantage unit will take to the ice for the first time tonight. Well, this power play shows up at a rather opportune time. They're trailing by one, and now a chance to level the score off. Aggression will be the key for them. Denied him on that last chance. Chicago's had their opportunities, but they still trail late in this second period. Grant's won a big draw on their own end. And manages to clear the zone. The Blackhawks gain possession along the wall. Here they come on the attack. Quick pass to Keith. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Gets it out of his own end. Chicago's got the puck along the boards. Wristwood in front. Takes that one right in the logo. And we're going to get a whistle here. Chicago's had plenty of good looks offensively, but they have been snake bitten as they trail late in this second period. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Moves it to Strom, and he stands tall in goal. There's another stop. I like the way he tracks the puck here. He's got to find it, and then he gets his body right in front of it. That's a good save. Chicago's had a lot of good looks offensively, but they have run into one hot goaltender, which is why they trail late in this second. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. Here's a short pass to Gustafson. Oh, what a stop! Really good puck control by the goalie as he gets it out of danger. Picked up along the wall by Larson. Raquel's got it on the offensive end. Great defensive play to come up with the puck. Hammers the shot, and he hangs on just as time runs out. And that'll do it for period number two. So two periods in the books, and it's 2-1. Hey, fans, a portion of tonight's proceeds will fund a children's playroom at City Hospital, providing a safe, fun environment. Don't go anywhere. Third period is just around the corner. If you'd like to learn more or to donate, please visit our team website. Welcome back, everyone. He's Ray. I'm James. Third period action, ready to go. Barring extra time, the final frame of this one. Here we go. Third period is underway. Ray, with two periods in the books, what are your thoughts on the game to this point? Chicago's pace and effort makes me think they're going to find this tying goal here, James. They've had the puck most of the first two periods. They've got the defense outnumbered. Musa quickly over to Del Sato. Blocked by the defender. Nice play. Oh, and a great defensive play there. 
Taves has the puck against the half wall and makes the save. The replay will show us that he's in good position and makes an excellent stick save to turn away a really good scoring chance. Lots of time left in this period. It's 2-1. Henrique's won it in their own end. Quick feed to Henrique. Takes it across the blue line. Henrique's got it deep in the offensive end. Chicago's looking to break out of their own end. Gets it to the other point. Puts it on net, denied by the goaltender. The Blackhawks have created numerous scoring chances, but they've just run into a hot goalie tonight here early in this third period. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. Carries it across the line with authority. Anaheim's got a hold of it against the wall. A howitzer and a great save. Great defensive stick work on the play. And the puck's booted away. Quick pass to Seabrook. Seabrook's moving the puck through his own zone. Great hit on the play. Strong's got the puck. And he slides it quickly to DeHaan. Big time stop there. Anaheim's got a hold of it along the wall. Chicago's got the puck now. Nice pass. Hammers one, and that's blocked away. Over the line they come. Look out, a two-on-one. And down he goes as the puck goes free. Let's it go. Stopped by the goaltender. Picked up along the boards by Shaw. Lays into the body. He carries the puck up along the wing. Puts it on net, and that one's turned away. Oh, that's a good look from the guys in the truck there. Look how he lines them up, times it perfectly, and throws his shoulder right through them. Chicago's Achilles heel tonight has been finding offense as they trail here in the third. Chance in front! Chicago's got control of it now from their own end. Throws it in. The Ducks get a hold of the puck along the boards. And it's freed up over to his teammate with a nice kick pass. Moves it to Jones. Stopped by the goaltender. Oh, he had to get up tight to the puck. In close. He takes away any room. Anaheim's got the puck in their own end. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. Along the half wall with the puck. Denied by the goaltender. More than half the period has expired. It's a 2-1 game. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Mata stick handling in his own zone. Saad's going to play it against the half wall. Quick shot, turns him away. Chicago's had more shots on goal, but yet they've run into a hot goalie. They trail late in this third period. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. And that one stopped. A critical draw here. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. With the stop. Through center along the wing. Heads deep inside the offensive zone. Comes up with the stop. Gibson's really had to be dialed in tonight. He's been busy since the beginning of the game, and he's been excellent. Just here in the late stages of this frame, we've got a 2-1 game. Taves has it in their own end. Looks to pass it to Murphy. 
feeds the puck over to Nylander. Here's a short pass to Taze. Oh, what a beautiful glove save! The Blackhawks are running out of time as they trail late in this third period. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Silverberg's moving it ahead. Takes a shot and he makes the save. Chicago's running out of time. They need to find a goal here quickly as they trail late in the third. Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Moves it quickly over to Del Sato. One minute left. Less than 60 seconds to play in this tight one. Chicago's gained possession along the boards. Kane's got it into offensive territory. Moves the puck inside the offensive zone. Stopped by the goaltender. Extra attacker out here with the empty net on the line with his face off. A lot of pressure on the centerman. You need the face off. Strom's won the draw. Let's it fly. Beautiful glove stop on that one. Del Sato's got it along the boards. To the empty net. Just wide of the net. Chicago's got the puck along the wall. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. That's an important time, of course, to make that stop. You've got the lead. You don't want to start letting it melt away. Chicago's offensive struggles have been the story tonight. Lots of chances, just not a lot of results. Face off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. With the steal. Angles it over to Saad. And now he angles it across to Gustafson. They desperately need a goal. The net is empty, and the extra attacker's out. Fowler's got it in the offensive zone. Tries to make a move and can't hang on to the puck. And that's just out of reach. Slides the puck across to Jones. Towards the gaping net. Off target. There's the final horn sounding, putting this baby to rest. Really good game for them. I thought they played well in several different segments of the game, including their face-off, where they controlled the puck a lot. And, and also in the defensive zone, in addition to the offensive zone Once there, Once they get the puck clean, they were able to get it out of the zone, and they did a nice job. And that'll do it from ringside, everyone. For Ray Ferraro, my name is James Sabalski. Get home safely. Thanks so much for joining us.